something threw a big monkey wrench into their scheme. I showed up. But then something went wrong. My body disappeared. Right, Cabanilla took it. My precious bargaining chip was in that body. I had to get it back. Oh, Carbonara. Why were those people targeting me? That's a good question. She was there that day, but like, that was it. Is this a pigeon? <laughs> I do wonder. Just because she was looking into it? I'm very excited. I'm very excited to find out what actually happens. And that's pretty much the whole story. Only thing left to do now is wait for the water pressure to crush the submarine. Oh, boo. No core is a link from here to the water surface. Why don't they just get into like a life vest and then just float it up? Or are they like so far down that they wouldn't be able to hold their breath long enough? We hook up the phone line and... Boo. Coffin for the dead. No escape. You'd be crap. Oh, yeah, actually true. They're pretty low. <laughs> he didn't gear up for this. He was not prepared. Cut off from the world, alone in a submarine. You don't gotta, you don't gotta empathize with the bad guy. I don't like this trope that much. He did a dumb dumb thing and they tried to kill you. Honestly, I don't care. <laughs> I don't feel bad for him. Good morning. We're not stuck. Don't worry. If my dad... Oh... Oh god. Don't make this sad. I don't want to cry. Two young ladies. <laughs> mm hmm. That's funny. There's something I don't understand. Why would they go to all the trouble of detaching the control room? Why didn't they just steal the Tumsic fragment and escape? Why did they have to jettison your body off into the sea? I think it kind of does matter why. Switch a submarine with a whale. If we find a whale-shaped submarine, or if we find a submarine-shaped whale. Oh, the tracker. Bullet is still in this person's body in the command room. But how does that help us? What about a torpedo? What are they just gonna like hold the torpedo and then <laughs> blast off? Alright. 
Everybody else wants to be positive. Got no reason to bring them down. <laughs> it's the story. It's the power of anime. Wednesday, how's it hanging? Really appreciate it. That made my night. Okay, I got some grapes. I don't know what I'm supposed to do with grapes. Let me try missile. Oh, I can't switch to missile. Okay. Telephone. Torpedo room. Pretty cool. Thank you. Coming to grapes with the situation. It's them grapes of wrath. I'm gonna use a missile to ram the control room. <laughs> Just explode the ship. Accidentally murder Detective Joust. I'm sure that'll be good. Alright, to the torpedo room we go. I couldn't fit a surrounding fun. <laughs> Load it into the tube. Please be careful, you're dealing with missiles. to the coordinates of the command room. Kawaii! It's done! I'm so proud of you. How it works. Sending good vibes. Now you can help me launch a torpedo. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Lower the switch. Switch broken. I will not be complicit. Boo! Pouring! I'm not trying to murder anybody. I actually don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. I'm just supposed to be launching torpedoes. Oh, I can turn a valve. You've got the five star rating. Can I switch to missile? I cannot. Okay. Spot. Oh, that's missile. I can't do the switch. Oh, now I can switch. Ha, huh. okay. No. Actually, I think I need to move Sissel. Let's try that. Now can I do it? No, 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 no. Aha! <laughs> Hi, hungry a million. <laughs> I love that joke. I'll set on this end too, something's odd. The command room is slowly sinking. Well, I don't think launching a missile at it's gonna help that very much. Guess I'll find out. Hop into the missile. Hop into the missile, Sissel. Seconds. Oh god, do I have to count to 12? Oh my god, please don't make me count to 12. <laughs> I 
I'm ready to count though. <gasps> Missile doesn't want to go. I'm sorry, I can't go. Oh, I can't leave Miss Lynn and Miss Camilla behind. Missile's so loyal. I love Missile. <laughs> You'll have to do the press, Sissel. I can't do it either. Oh. Although, I understand his want, but like, if he came with us, their rate of survival goes up pretty significantly. So I do think he should have come with us. You staying here won't change our fate. It's true. Thank God she said what I was thinking, because, like, literally, it just wouldn't have helped. I'll never be able to see you again. Well, if they die, you won't be able to see them again anyway. Might as well try. Don't worry, Missile. Best boy. Bestest, bestest. I'll be right here waiting for you. Aw, they're so cute. Camilla! Aw. Good doggo. Twelve seconds after I... Oh god, <laughs> I forgot I had to count to 12. I don't want to do this. Okay, I'm ready. <sighs> okay, not yet. <laughs> We never found out who you really were. She didn't click the switch. It's fine. It's fine for now. I'm truly glad I met you. Oh, that's nice for her to say. Yeah, no last goodbyes. This is not our last goodbye. Here goes then. This song. Oh my god. One, two, three. Am I supposed to count yet? Four, <laughs> five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I don't think I actually have to count. Eleven, twelve. Okay. These twelve seconds are last. Actually, it lasted twelve seconds until I got to this text. Six. Oh God. <laughs> Before I can think of an answer, the 12 seconds are up. Am I supposed to count now? Please don't make me count. Ain't that convenient. Ja, we got it's wake up time. I'm gonna bite him. <laughs> he might break your teeth. What's up, Jow? Let's have a chat. Who are you? It's Sissel. I can't believe you made it here. Camilla and Lynn are okay for now, but they need your help. We don't have time for long stories. Okay, I guess we did. Why would he do that to his own submarine? Who's talking? Oh! <gasps> what? You! How did he get here? I didn't even notice. Did he bring the robot parts with him? Are you a Yomiel? Yomiel? What? I don't like where this is going. I don't know where this is going. I'm so confused. Oh my god. Yomiel? 
I don't... That's a weird name. We got the name! And they were calling you Sissel... Is an alias. Oh. I guess. Could you do me a favor? Would you let me ask you some questions? I have so many questions. Sure. Let's tell me about your meal. You were a top systems engineer? I know, right? It's only been a day. It's been one day. I've been playing this game for like months. By the way, I'm a top Pomeranian. <laughs> Missile's adorable. I was one of the best in the industry. It took 12 hours. Hey, Koki! Koki, how are you? Welcome to the end of the game. Holy cow, we're so far in. One night. Reorganizing the nation's top secret information. Build the new system using multi-dimensional programming theory. All right, you lost me. Call me Missile, cause I don't know what he's talking about. Yeah, it's been a while, cause I've been playing this game in like two, three hour chunks. It doesn't sound like anything a Mugen would know about either. <laughs> it's a challenging job. However, I mean, it sounds like a pretty dangerous job to begin with. Alex, it depends. Usually I would end like now, or like latest 30 minutes from now, but I guess we'll see how far we can get. We might save the very, very end for next week, or I might push through. How long am I willing to go? Oh, uh, not that long. I do have to get up early. But I won't stop in the middle of their conversation or anything. Maybe the next puzzle I might stop. Finish it off next week. I was the guy who built the core of the system. What's the next game? The next game is... A game I don't remember the name of. It's the one that... Kirby? No. It's the one that Rude recommended. That's gonna go there. And then I'm gonna finish Pokemon Shield, maybe tomorrow? We'll see. And then after that, Kawaii's game is going in. Outer Wilds. Yes, thank you, Outer Wilds. Outer Wilds going in, and then Kawaii's bartending simulator with robots is going in. I'm excited. It's gonna be fun. After this conversation, thank you. All right, I will definitely do that then. Valhalla, yeah, Valhalla. All right, then that's a good, perfect place after this conversation. And then we'll be done after next week and then I'll readjust the schedule. When was it that I was proven innocent? Six months after your death. Oh, that's painful. That's, that's not good. I'm so sorry, Yomiel. Again, it was all Carbonara's fault. <laughs> I could, I could, Nyx. I'm not gonna do that to myself or you guys. Ooh, hey, animated. I went boom again. My soul is split from my body and I've lost everything. Sealed in eternal darkness. This music is really good. Oh. 
Good for my powers. They didn't help anybody. Not even the passage of time could heal my pain. This track in particular reminds me of some of the Phoenix Wright OST. I wanted it to disappear. I wasn't even allowed to do that. That's sad. I wanted all of you to suffer what I was suffering. You shouldn't murder somebody who had nothing to do with it. Like, you want to murder Zhao, you want to murder Cabanilla, like, it's stupid, but I get it. But to murder, like, his wife, that's just... That's when you know you've lost your humanity entirely. The twisted wish of a mind poisoned by infinite loneliness. Mm -hmm. Plan to use these powers of mine to make a deal. Deal or no deal. What's the deal? Ghost manity. It's something I just don't understand. What would you get? Actually, good point. What would he get? I revenge, I guess. Oh. Wait, what? One, help me with my revenge plot. Two, a rebirth for me. <laughs> Just baptize Sizzle. Sizzle? Sizzle? Sizzle. Just throw him in the water. Didn't care if it was fake life, artificial life. I wanted a physical receptacle for my soul. Oh, that's sad. It's <laughs> really sad. Finally, I wanted to die surrounded by a loving family. Oh, okay, that's pretty sad. But the thing I don't understand is why couldn't he have done that by himself? He has a body. He could have just, like, been in society. I don't totally understand the problem. Why was he in darkness if his body regenerated? Why couldn't he have just, like, gone and talked to people and started a life? I guess his body doesn't age, but, like, he could have still found people who loved him and then grew old with them, even though he didn't physically age. And then, like, say he got a wife. If his wife passed away, he could just, like, I don't know, rip out his meteor fragment and then die. I don't know, man. He could have just made a new look for himself and lived under the radar. I don't... I, th I think it's being a little overdramatic. Is this a baby? Ooh. That's kind of very creepy, actually. <laughs> just give him a baby. It could. I think that's one solution to his problems. I don't think he necessarily wanted a baby, but made him an artificial body. That I can understand a little better. Still a lot of science involved. But they got betrayed. Tell me about the betrayal. See, you could have been a spy. You could have been a really good spy. They figured out what Tamsik was all about. I was a fool. Why did they make a deal with you? Well, probably to get the fragment. Ooh, this is a good point though. Why didn't they just take it from the park? 
Maybe they wanted all of it, so they didn't want him running around. They couldn't. Why not? Research was conducted in this country, too. Oh? God, this guy. They decided to put the park under surveillance. What? They're armed agents there at all times. No way. No way. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, this is the biggest twist of the game. Tiny piece of tennessee. <laughs> Can you imagine? Wow. He's just weird. He's just a weirdo. Although, realistically, how hard would it have been to just, like, go into the place with, like, a hundred thousand people, or, like, a thousand people, and just storm the park and take the fragments? Like, if it's really that valuable? The government didn't take it seriously enough. So the upshot of your grand deal was this. There's one thing you can be happy about. Well, that doesn't... I hope that doesn't make him very happy now. Revenge is unfulfilling. Started with what? Brain detective job back to life, of course. Give up. We're so good. We're gonna do our best. Return to the past now. Hey, Sal. Welcome in. How are you doing this fine Wednesday? Got it, little song. Where are we headed? <laughs> we are not headed anywhere, detective. not a real guy? Is he a robot? I thought he was a real guy. <laughs> it's an advanced game. It's the ghost trick. Wait a minute. Do, is my stream name Mahjong? Oh, thank god. Okay. <laughs> you scared me. I was like, no, I made a big mistake. You trapped your doom. a robot. What? They could have made him an artificial body. Oh my god. I am a remote control and robot. He always looked like he had his own personality. Wow. Are all the blue people robots? There's nothing but a shell. It's hardly a threat. What you talking about? There's no need for you to know. Well, you, why you tell me stuff? Why you give me hints if you don't want me to know? <gasps> That's a gun. That's somebody with a gun. <laughs> Great. 
Sticker. No. Ow. He got shoot in. Apparently, yeah, there's a lot of people with the guns today. It isn't. Remember what Big Mask Man said? Any possibility, no matter how small. Which means, yeah, there is a possibility. We just gotta teach Yo... Yomiya? We have to teach him the power of friendship. <laughs> it is a bad design decision. Me, the mystery. All right, so I'm gonna save it here. This was awesome. I'm so excited. I'm so excited for next week. I'm gonna like party after I finish this game. Very, very looking forward to it. Thank you, Palix. So I'll be stomping here for tonight and then I'll finish this game no matter what. No matter how long I get stuck on the puzzle, I'm gonna finish this game next stream. So that'll be next Wednesday. Probably, yeah, next Wednesday for everybody. No matter what time zone, next Wednesday. What are my stream times? My stream time is now. Monday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Every day except Tuesday and Sunday. And I stream the same game every same day of the week. So next Wednesday will be Ghost Trick. Thursday is always gonna be Pokemon. Friday, different Pokemon and so on. So just tune in same day next week. Or if you want, I'll be playing Pokemon Shield tomorrow if you would like to tune in. I'm hoping to finish the game tomorrow. Right? Talk oh my gosh, yeah, we should have a good chat. That'd be fun. That's a good idea. Okay, I'll totally, I'll figure it out. Yeah, I can't wait. We gotta discuss things. We could have time to discuss. Oh yeah, it's all coming together. Hey, Carrot! Carrot, welcome in! I'm about to end, but I'm glad I got to see you. Good night, good night. Okay, wait. While we're here, let me look at what's going on on Twitch.com. God, so many people are here because with the longer games especially the mystery based ones like this one the plot is so linear i didn't think a whole lot of people would be here from beginning to end of this game but like here we go hey Vivan. i'm so sorry yeah i'm wrapping up now yep we gonna be raiding does anybody have a raid suggestion I don't know if there's anybody else playing Ghost Trick right now. I could look. <gasps> Nyx! <laughs> Holy crap! <laughs> Thank you so much for the gift subs. Oh my goodness. <sighs> You're so sweet. I really appreciate it. Nyx is amazing. Nyx is a White Elm 2 fan for anybody else who's in the stream who knows that game. It comes up a lot in conversation here. Thank you, you're amazing. Thank you, thank you. <laughs> not Pokimane. I will not raid Pokimane. I made the mistake. Oh, oh okay. yeah. You're incredible. I don't think anybody else playing Ghost Track. I'm gonna check though. Cause you never know. Always raid Pokimane? Oh yeah, it's just me. <laughs> it's only me. All right, then I'm just going to send you guys over to Hoy. Hoy is playing through Marvel Ultimate Alliance, which I played a long time ago. Oh, you got a dub tonight, Fiba. That's awesome. Congrats. I have to type in this properly. Hoy. Bam. What happened? I spelled her name wrong. <laughs> So I just sent everybody to a, like a false link. That's what happened. <laughs> because Andy, when I first started streaming, I didn't know what I was doing. And Andy was like, raid Pokemon. I was like, okay. Except Andy spelled it wrong. And so I sent everybody to a blank room. 
Thank you, Palix. I appreciate it. And it was really nice to meet you today. So, sorry, I'm dragging this on. I'm just so excited. This has been so much fun. <laughs> Andy, I don't believe you. <laughs> it was probably my fault, though. Good night, you guys. If you're around, I'll be playing Pokemon tomorrow. It'll be super good. <laughs> I'm not gonna check the log. I'm not gonna check. <laughs> you guys are awesome. Thank you for being my friends. This has been really, really funny. <laughs> exactly, Pokey. I'm gonna get timed out because I already started the raid timer, so. <laughs> Have a great one, you guys. Have a great day. Sleep well if it's nighttime for you. I'll catch you later. Bye bye.